How's that flow anyways today? Probably shit. Hey, uh, oh yeah, that's, that's horrible flow. Ah, God. Today we have some snow. All right, so I'm taking my car out for the first drive of the year in the shitty weather. It snowed last night, uh, the roads are plowed. Of course they're salted. Um, but yeah, I literally just passed somebody, the first person I passed, and he gave one of these looks at me as I went by. He's like, so I looked at him, <laughs> I looked back at him like, so what I'm curious is, because the roads have this like little slushiness on them, is how well these winter tires are going to grip. All right, so in today's vlog, I'd like to take us to the Schitt's Creek Motel. It's out near Orangeville, which is about an hour-ish drive away. We're gonna check that out after the gym. I'm already halfway through the gym, and uh, I just like to see it uh, take you by. Just check out the set. I love that show. I'm sure everybody loves that show now. It's, I've never even heard of it until it came out on Netflix, and it's like, oh, they have eight seasons. Okay. Anyway, I'd like to go go there, check it out, maybe make a little adventure vlog today. All right. So the gym didn't last too long because, well, I just didn't feel like being there. Rick, you know what I'm talking about. I see. Rick at the gym, he's like, you leaving so soon? Yeah, Rick, yeah, I am. Uh, so we're on our way to Rosebud Motel in uh, Mono. So it's about an hour drive from where I live. That's actually turned out to be a beautiful day. Yeah, I don't really know exactly what to expect when we get there. Uh, they are selling this motel as well. I think it's $2 million or $2.5 million. I, uh, it's probably not worth it. It's probably mostly inflated because the TV show was shot there. Uh, I, I, I don't really see how a 10 room motel is worth $2 million, but hey, I'm not in the motel game. What do I know? I'll tell you the problem with doing these vlogs sometimes, because I do them over the course of a day. So two, two hours ago, or I don't know what time it was, 11? Around nine o'clock, yeah, two hours ago, I videoed the starting of my car, went back into the driveway, set a bunch of stuff, a couple hours later, I just don't remember if I told you to hit the subscribe button. Gotcha. Uh, not much to do until we get there or talk about. I know what we should talk about. We should talk about a couple YouTubers I follow uh, who I consider friends or social media friends. Of course, Quentin Mother TV. I think I followed Quentin for about three years. Q, what do you think? Three, four years? Anyways, you guys want to see a guy that is a great cartoonist, and I know I only have like a hundred people watching these things. It's not, it's not, it's not great promotion. But if you want to see a great cartoonist where you will laugh your ass off the whole time, Quentin TV is where you want to check out next. And Juliana Schiavetti, the automotive woman, has a great automotive channel. She does How To Tuesdays as well as Feature Car Fridays. So How To, she just teaches you the tricks and tips on little maintenance uh, issues, changing your tires, uh, light bulbs, air filters, cabin air filters in your vehicle, as well as she features different vehicles, whether it be a Lamborghini, McLaren, or even a Kia. So if you want, check Giuliano out. That's a, it's a great channel. So we're in the town of Mono, and a fun fact about Mono, my best good friends in the world, Tuna and Joanne. Joanne is from Mono. She grew up here. That's all I gotta really say about that. I don't really know what else to say. Hey, there it is. <laughs> so we just passed the motel now, but there's, of course, a bunch of people out front. Nothing like driving an hour and you can't even go there yet. We're just around the corner 
uh, from the hotel or motel I should say but uh, there's a car parked there and I feel funny and weird going there so we're just gonna give them five ten minutes to kind of hopefully leave otherwise I'm just gonna go back there but I just want to show you how beautiful this little bridge is and I got a little creek here all right okay that's enough uh, to around I'm gonna go there just drive down quickly vlog talk about it a little bit and then get the hell out of there before I get in trouble I'm not getting out because the car's behind me. I'm sure I'm trespassing right now. But yeah, this is it. The old Schitt's Creek uh, Motel. I'm sure nobody would even care if I was here, but here, I'll even give you a little thing. I believe right there is where their number five is where their little rooms are. But, I don't know, it looks cool. Yeah, we're not gonna stick around too long. I'm sure they're annoyed with people pulling their cars and doing this shit all the time. Okay, so how was that? Uh, I couldn't really get too much into it because uh, there was a car parked there. I didn't want somebody coming out and yelling at me for trespassing. But uh, anyways, we're gonna end the vlog there. I hope you liked the little shot of Schitt's Creek uh, Motel there. The Rosebud Motel is for sale for what, $2 million or something like that. Anyways, thank you very much for watching. Subscribe and I'll see you on the next one.